Sabaha everybody and welcome back to the channel. In today's video we're going to check out a pair of budget ANC wireless earbuds. They're called the Earfun Free Pro from Earfun and they provide us a lot of the functionalities and a lot of features that we typically see in $100 and plus pair of earbuds. Uh, namely gesture control, wireless charging in the case, USB-C charging, uh, but not only that, ANC with pass-through mode as well as normal mode. Like and subscribe and make sure you hit that bell icon so that you're always notified to whenever we have new videos on the channel. Now, before we go too far, I do want to say thank you very much to Earfun for providing me that 20% coupon that's available for you guys in the description below in case you want to be able to get these guys for under 50 bucks, for about like 47 bucks. Really a great, great deal for you guys. So this is the actual packaging itself. You get the headphones themselves that are already inside of their case. And of course, we have a manual here that shows us everything that we need. Uh, some additional tips here as well as stabilizers and we'll get a chance to talk about those. And of course, a USB-C cable to be able to charge them. Keep in mind that these guys are also supporting wireless charging on the base. So you just have to put them straight on and any kind of Qi enabled wireless charger and you'll be able to charge them just as easy. And of course, if you have a device that supports reverse wireless charging, you can charge your headphones on the go without any wires. Now, as far as the box itself, it's rated to go all the way up to 32 hours worth of battery usage. Now that's including a fully charged earphones as well as the actual case itself. Active noise cancellation, a four mic array, as well as IPX5 rated here. And of course, Bluetooth 5.2 to support long range and of course, better performance. We also have a couple of modes here, standard mode as well as low latency mode for us to get a better experience uh, gaming whenever we're using these earbuds. And the back of the box kind of just outlines everything that we just talked about them. We have the earbuds themselves, the case, the tips, the controls, uh, the actual stabilizers, the USB-C, the instruction manual, and of course, all the ratings that we talked about them. If you'd like to check them out, please go ahead and pause the video and read them there. The case itself is very nice and small. On the back, we have a USB-C charger. On the bottom, we have the wireless charger. Again, you can charge with any Qi enabled wireless charger. The casing itself has a couple of LEDs, one on the front and on the each ear tip itself. We have four microphones on each ear, uh, ear tip or earbud itself. And of course, fully charged gives us the ability of using them for up to seven hours at about 50 to 60% volume level with ANC off. And of course, up to 32 hours if you include the 25 hours worth of charging that come with the case itself. And realistically, the battery lasts for a long, long time. We have a couple of pin connectors here on each earbud to charge using the pin connection on the back here. And of course, that little nice stabilizer that I showed you guys at the beginning, we have additional ones in the box. They always make sure that you have a really good fit. Now, where you see the word earphone at the top here, this is the touch sensitive controls, which they have a lot. And we'll go ahead and get a chance to check them out. They're all outlined directly in the book. Uh, but as far as the actual fit, make sure you get the right ear tips as well as stabilizers, and then you'll get a really good snug fit to get that ANC working at the level that we want. Now, because there's so many gestures here, I wanted to give you guys a quick heads up. So there's basically pause and play. There's the ability of turning on volume up and volume down by just simply pressing on each ear. So the left is volume down, the right is volume up. There's no way to reconfigure them. So these are pretty much just standard across both earbuds themselves. Answer and hang up calls, answer and transfer two great calls if you want to be able to do that. And of course, the ability of activating the assistant if you have one set up on your device. Uh, lastly, we have the ability here of turning on noise cancellation by basically uh, triple tapping on the left ear. And of course, changing between noise cancellation, ambient mode and normal mode. And it does actually have a pretty good uh, ANC activation here on there. Last but not least is the ability of turning on uh, low latency and that's basically by pressing and holding for two seconds on the left ear but and that enables us to turn on low latency mode for whenever we're watching movies or playing games using them. There's no app on the smartphone, there's no way to basically change them. So if you're using it with an Android or an iOS device, it's gonna work the exact same way. Very small, very minimalistic. The touch sensitivity is actually very good and the ability of skipping forward uh, as far as the tracks and of course raising and reducing the volume is very, very functional. Most uh, earbuds that you find on the market now don't provide you even that feature alone. Now for a quick example of how does the audio or the microphones work here, we're using obviously uh, just audio recording over Bluetooth. So this should be a good example of how the audio sounds and of course, how does it actually sound when I'm talking and there's a little bit of a lawnmower going on and you're uh, not that far from where I am. So again, good example of how the earphone earphones or the true wireless earbuds here perform. And again, there are 60 bucks. Now, the last thing I also wanna share with you guys obviously is the range. A lot of us worry, how far can I go with these earbuds from my phone without losing connection? Uh, and for that, I did a quick test in my backyard where I was able to walk from one side of my house all the way to the other side of my, which essentially is the last part of my backyard. 
And of course, having the house between me and the phone, the audio was still playing, controls were still working. So you should have no problem being able to use these earphones or earbuds uh, and walking around the house without having to carry your phone with you. Now, the ANC on these actually work pretty well. And coupled with the fact that these earbuds are in-ear, not over the ear, they provide us already kind of a noise dampening factor by default by just putting them in. Uh, the triple tap on the left earbud enables ANC. And of course, if you triple tap it again, it takes you into normal mode and of course, ambient mode. But it actually works nice enough that it's actually amplifying ever so nicely the surrounding sound so you can hear a little bit better. Uh, no way of increasing the ambient functionality is pretty much just set. Uh, I think normal and ANC are very functional. And again, for the, for the price point that these earbuds are providing us, it's a great budget. Uh, and I think it's like a great bang for the buck when it comes down to that. Now, as far as charging, wireless or wired, both will work very nicely for you guys. The battery on these will last for a very long time. Let's start talking about audio quality. So I would probably say the best way to describe these earbuds or the sound quality that comes out of them is that they're definitely a little bit bass heavy. What that means essentially it's tuned for more to be uh, slightly more uh, higher on the bass profile. So the mids and lows are a little bit over extenuated, which actually works pretty well if you listen to EDM, dance or any kind of uh, hip hop music that tends to have a little bit more bass. So if you enjoy that, these are definitely going to be the pair of earbuds for you. Uh, mids and highs actually sound pretty good. Um, I do feel like the overall profile is definitely uh, tuned more towards uh, dance and EDM, mostly because of the way it sounds, but I like the way they work. There's no way to change them, unfortunately. There's no app, but then uh, overall, you're not gonna be disappointed for the price point. I think overall for what they're offering us, they're giving us wireless charging, wire charging. They're giving us gesture control to be able to turn on ANC, as well as actually having low latency, which is also another function in here. If you're using them to listen to music generally without watching anything on the screen, I recommend not worrying about low latency but if you're watching movies, definitely turn that on by double tapping on the left earpiece. Uh, a lot of gesture functionalities in there. It takes about a, maybe a couple of minutes to get used to, but once you have them set up, they sound great. Their function is very, very nice. And again, at a very good price point. Overall, if you're looking for a pair of earbuds that are on a budget, they're definitely not going to win to disappoint. I want to say thank you very much to Earfund for allowing me to check them out. I've used them for the last couple of weeks as my primary pair of earbuds for conference calls for over two hours, uh, making receiving phone calls as well. As you saw with the video sample there, the audio actually sounds pretty good from the quad mic setup that we have here. And again, at the end of the day, the ability of being able to charge them wirelessly from my smartphone on the go makes them even more functional for a great price. Don't forget to make sure to check out that coupon in the description below if you'd like to be able to save 20% off your order, making these guys for under 50 bucks. Like and subscribe as usual. Thank you very much to Earfun and for you guys to checking out this video. And I'll see you guys in the next one.